Apparently a lettuce lover. That makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> Let's buy all the stuff. No, back to okay. Anyway, back to game. <laughs> okay, so, so anyway, uh, if the, bur the trees and burgers in the other one. How come they're not uh, uh, tacos in this one? I'm actually quite surprised you remember that they're burgers. I haven't seen anything related to any trees at all in this game yet. Yeah. When are you uh, starting the recording? Oh, you mean like uh, like 19 seconds ago? Oh, you started it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever eat it in the beginning? <laughs> Probably did. Oh, for God's sake! I didn't know you'd started <laughs> it. I was just like, I'm a fucking Maltesers, man. I'm a nin I'm a ninja when it comes to starting videos. Well, might as well fucking eat one last bit because you know. I'm I fat. need to I need to stop using these sauces on the videos because the last video we did had probably the laggiest picture I have ever seen. You can't see anything happening. Like at the end, you know when I said that OBS had paused the recording, it actually did. You heard everything we said, but you didn't see a thing. Like at all. It's fucking annoying. It really is. <laughs> is that so? Yeah, that's so. It did actually crash when it uh, stopped at that point. Pretty much, yeah. The picture crashed, and at the end, it was like maybe did five it minutes. Back? It did eventually, but at the end, it was like five minutes of black screen. Why am I putting this sauce on? It's it's really annoying, but because of the funny stories, I just kind of kept it there. Oh, yo, you know um, <laughs> that Counter Strike tournament I was in today. Yeah. yeah. We played uh, four games. The the last one took ages. Uh, sorry about that, but um, uh, there was this one where this guy on the enemy team was really obsessed with me, and he got that obsessed with me that he changed his name to my exact name as well. <laughs> well, why was he obsessed with you? Was he like really mad at you or something? I don't know. No, I, I sent him. I, I put in the chat. Like, I was taking the piss. Like, was I his name a bit banter with the enemy team because they were all like, cool. They were. His name was Herbert. I can't even remember what I exactly said. It was something like. Uh, How'd you miss that shot? And then a winky face. Yeah. As a joke. As a joke, obviously. Ah. Uh, I see where you're coming and, uh, with this. The others weren't, weren't bothered. They were laughing. And then one guy was like, for the rest of the game, he started proper getting on at me. It was like, everything I did, he'd be like, oh, how'd you miss that? Oh, you're so shit. And I'd be like, fucking hell, man. Calm like, down, mate. Name after everything, saying, nice half gam. Nice round gam. Like, because my name in uh, Steam's Gamma Blood. Oh, yeah, it is. And, uh, <laughs> Yeah, and I was like, Jesus Christ, what the fuck? He's obsessed with me. Like, <laughs> it's totally weird. Sentence, he'd just say Gamma Vlad in my fucking game. <laughs> I was actually fucking scared. To make, I, he's trying to make sure that you know he's there and you know he he, like he's a looking. Psychopath. I bet he, he sounded like the kind of guy that fucking walks into Walmart, picks a gun off the shelf, loads <laughs> it with fucking rounds, and just shoots everyone with the fucking letter J at the beginning of the name. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? It's, it's like proper homicidal. No, genocidal, even. You know, one of my teachers um, in year two. Yeah. Well, she wrote something on the board. I'd imagine somebody probably did, like, uh, probably got their name written on the board or something. But yeah. I don't know. She used the whiteboard pen and she went over to the smart board and um, she started writing something on the board and realised she still had the whiteboard pen left this massive mark on the smart <laughs> board. <laughs> and she tried to hide it from the other teacher. Because we had like this one teacher on Monday and Tuesday, and we had her on every other day. And the thing about this this teacher who did that was really creepy. Like everywhere you look, she's there, as if she's like a slitheen or something. But like <laughs> when I left the school a few about maybe a month later, the thing with like the the thing on the VR board was still there, and I'd imagine maybe it's still there today. <laughs> There's just a massive mark, and she was like, "Oh dear, now how do I get this off?" There are whiteboards yet. Yeah. At college, you know the smart bots. Hmm. I thought those shitty smart bots were the, the only ones they ever made, but we've got like a proper high tech Samsung one at uh, our college. High tech Samsung. It's like a big tablet. It works so well. Like you know the old one where they had to keep doing that fucking thing where they had to orientate it. Oh yeah. Like, I remember that. They used to. The projector is always slanted. As well. They used to like. They used to always get this um this pen and like have to tap it the X's. Always too far fucking. It was always too close uh, to the screen. Like, the resolution was shit. It was always slanted to one side. Oh, literally every time, yeah. One side as well. Every time. It was always, like, really bad and you yeah. could hardly see the and other sentence. When they went to draw on the board, it'd be, like, two meters below where they bloody drew. Once they did this, um... <laughs> yeah, because the drawing is, like, ten minutes. It's, like, yeah, two meters. <laughs> the board and it fucking starts drawing. It starts pointing at the task. One of, my, one of my teachers got really mad at that once and threw the pen on the ground. I was like, God! <laughs> and then they were like, "Wait, I need to use this." <laughs> Picked up a You know the, uh, you know that little orientation thing. I used to think that was a game that they just liked playing. <laughs> Same you know, where here, they have to yeah. press, press the middle. 
You know when um you know when I first went to um a, a secondary school right, we yeah. every student got their own netbox, like to keep until the end. <laughs> me and my brother just me and DJ just recorded. Me and my brother just left some really weird videos. I remember there was a video on there where uh, we were like impersonating <laughs> some kid we hated, and it was like, and I should rule the world. Mm -hmm. And every time we made that noise, we just like, <laughs> like <laughs> shake our heads all the time. It was like a really lucky picture. Can you just imagine if the yeah. teachers like went up there and found these videos? I was like, what are these kids on? <laughs> You can just imagine what the reactions would be when they saw them. Just get a fucking knock on your door one day and it's like, Hello, we're from the asylum down the road, we're here to assess your psychiatric evaluation. <laughs> it appears that you have an obsession with this... <laughs> <laughs> what even was that? Like, I don't even... It's the way they ins oh, why do they inspect attackers like that? They're just like, proper put their face in there like... Mm, it's like... Got, uh... <laughs> presented well. It's like, in, it's like the weirdest yeah, attacker ever is like, hmm, I ordered this. <laughs> I love how they just look at it. It's like, did I order this? Yes, I totally did order a raw taco with a little blob of sauce. Uh, what's, what's just remind me of? I was having a run for at college, <laughs> uh, not college work. Right. And, uh, the <laughs> fucking right. You know wine tasters. Yeah. They get paid, yeah, like really handsomely as well. Really. To put drink in their mouth. Swish it around and then spit it back out about two seconds later, <laughs> and they get paid for that. They spit it out and say, like, mm, "Yes, that tastes paid great." More than people who get shot at every bloody day in the army for a living. And also, they also the risk their lives all the time as well. So why would And then spit it out, get paid more than people who get shot at. Why? What the hell? No, That's so like, weird. Why do they even get paid for that? It's fucking why. <laughs> it's just. <laughs> it's just what even is that? They literally take a sip, spit it out, and they, then that's like a hundred grand in the bank for them. <laughs> there you go, you had a drink. There we go, we're done. Now, imagine... Just, like, <laughs> literally, what I do all day is... Um, some days I record videos, and some days I just kind of sit down and play either play GTA or like watch YouTube videos all day. Imagine if I got paid for that. Oh, that'd be brilliant. <laughs> oh, and I also, I also spend all day shiny hunting and getting nothing recently, so there we go. If I got paid for getting nothing, I'd be a millionaire. I just misheard that, like, really badly. I spend all day shagging. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is definitely what I do. It wasn't as funny as last night, though, because me and Aiden, uh, me, Aiden and Mitch, we were playing Counter-Strike. Uh, the guy you play as on this game is called Mitch as well. Is he? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, me, Aiden and Mitch were playing on Counter-Strike last night, and Aiden went to go, fuck's sake, uh, because uh, he died, and he went, fuck, and then Discord made it go, whoa, <laughs> like, because, you know, it glitches. <laughs> And then he came back and went, say, like that, and it's just, <laughs> it's so stupid. I like how um, once, you know when we were doing that one conversation, and I was just sat there talking, and the recording was like, and I heard that, uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine a rigged game show, where like the um, the last answer is like, what am I going to have for dinner tonight? Can you imagine that? And then it's like, uh, wait a minute, how am I supposed to know that? Sarge fan? Look at this person, what the hell? And um, it's like, oh, you're going to have pizza, correct. And then um, they win, they go home, and then five minutes after they get home, they got a knock on the door. Sorry, um, the person the person who gave you the question has changed their mind, we'll have to take all this million dollars back. <laughs> <laughs> that would be, be the stupidest thing ever. Yeah. He's changed his mind, he's having chips instead. I'm sorry, but you're not allowed this money anymore. What is that TV show on the... Uh... On the TV in that fucking game. Cause it's mm, like it, I don't know, actually. It looks really weird. I've just been watching it for the past two minutes. Uh, what, what is it? Like? What it's the? Like it, <laughs> what is that? It's like a. Wait, it's that like, kind of. What was that? A on a Harley bike throwing a banana at a car. It's, ca it's Farm Cart. It's Grand Theft Cow. Fa farm Cart 8. <laughs> With unlockable characters oh, uh, Shark and uh, Fish. It looks like a really fat skiss. <laughs> what? Although this guess is quite fat anyway. What? <laughs> nah, I'm joking. People always like to... Going back to what you were saying about being paid on YouTube earlier. Well, about the, um... Uh, like, yeah. what, watching it's it. It's going or... down the shit here at the moment, the uh, YouTube website. Oh, yeah, it's like... Uh... in the analytics in that. Yeah, apparently they've it's been... It's like total views are down by literally 50%. That's weird. It's like it's like nobody uses YouTube anymore. It's because they keep changing shit. 
and then no one likes how they've changed it because it fucks them over. Like, uh, every time someone uploads now, they lose about 200 subscribers. That's really weird as well. It hasn't affected me yet, but I, I, I bet, like, I upload a video, it's like, you have zero subs now. Haha, <laughs> <Fun. laughs> Yeah. That's what it does. It's for some and I'm like, great. YouTube's algorithm sometimes, like, unsubscribes people, even though they didn't unsubscribe themselves, if you know what I mean. I've had that happen to me before. Yeah. It hasn't happened to me personally. But like, I went. Fucking annoyed if it happened to you. Like, for some reason, it said I was unsubscribed to Fail Race. I was like, no, I'm not. I'm still subscribed to him, haven't I? Uh, you, know, you know, it says he's a sergeant fan, yeah? Sarge. Yeah. Sarge uh, fan. He had a Lance Jack, so he was not a sergeant. That stripe on his head was a Lance, uh, Lance Corporal, or Lance Bombardier. So you mean this sergeant is a fake? Yes. Dun dun dun. Do 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 do. Cadet knowledge on you there, sorry. Do your rendition of the X Files. I love that. What was it? What was it that we found? What was it like? And you remember the um? You remember the um? Do you remember when we saw that thing written on the wall and you went? What was that? I can't remember. I don't remember it was what was written on the wall. It was like something about a luminosity, like a triangle, and just went diddle it in. No, I think, I think someone had drawn like something, and then I, I pointed out a triangle, and I went, <gasps> diddle it, diddle it, diddle it, and just turned to you and did that. <laughs> I, went, I went back to watch one of our episodes where I was talking about the. Um, you remember when I was on about like writing on the writing on the walls? Like the, yeah. You know, in, you know what they wrote in. But <laughs> anyway, I went back to watch that, and I realised it's like. As soon as I start imp imp doing an impression of the head teacher, I start having voice breaks. It's like, and Shit. someone has even got their own feces on the wall. Ah, oh, you know, fucking voice breaks. Yeah. I hate them so much because they always choose the, the worst uh, time. The, the worst times to bloody go on because, like, I've had them I'm on my videos a lot. Pretty sure I finished puberty. Like, I mean, come on. <laughs> it's like when you see these other YouTubers do it. Yeah, it's like um, Once. it's like the uh, people in GTA so, Five, isn't it? Like the other day, for example, yeah. Uh, I was walking, uh, walking down, my voice had been fine all day, walking through the, uh, hallway in, uh, North Lindsay. Uh, this, this, uh, really, really nice looking girl, uh, opens the door for me, she's really nice, really hot, and I go to say thank you, and I go, thank you, like that, oh, <laughs> oh god, so now she's gonna think I'm a prepudescent fucking 12 year old for the rest of the year. You know, this you is, know I mean? <laughs> it kind of reminds me of those people on GTA 5, like, you know the NPCs that always insult you? Like, you hear him go, dirtbag! I'm like, excuse me, what? <laughs> was that supposed to be insulting? I, I can't take you seriously. I was playing Grand Theft Auto the other day. On my PC. And, uh... Threw a Molotov at this group of people. Set them on fire. And they were all going, ah, on the floor, yeah? And then some random guys from the crowd ran over and started kicking the ones that were already dead. <laughs> even though they were still on fire, so then they start kicking and then set themselves on fire and just went, ah! I saw these, them. I saw these paramedics, right? They were driving to go and save somebody, but they got hit by somebody. So they got out of the car, pulled the guy out of the car, beat him to death, stole his car, <laughs> ran over the guy who was already dead, who they were supposed to be helping, and just buggered off. And he actually left his, he left his co-worker behind, so I punched his co-worker in the face. <laughs> I love how it's like, we're supposed to <laughs> save these people, we're gonna yeah, kill 13 people on the back. way. Huh? We're gonna kill all thirteen people on the way here to save one guy. It's <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> Paramedics start beating the shit out of us. It's it's like when the cops did it, isn't it? They start beating just beating each other up. It's like, what are you guys doing? You're on the whose side are you on? They fucked up some of the NPCs. I get, I bet. But they, someone would have coded that in. You know what I mean? Yeah, I searched. I, I searched up um. The uh, Forza Horizon PC thing, and nothing comes up about it. It's like this is an Xbox exclusive, even though it's clearly not. I bet if I tried to run it on this computer, it would probably lag, stutter, and crash a lot. Because GTA does that. Is it the one? Is it? Is it the uh, Forza Horizon, which is uh, open world? Yeah, it's the third one. Oh, I was gonna say the new if one. It was yeah. The ones where it goes around the tracks, then you'd be fine if it's open world, because uh, it basically works off your CPU and. Uh, You'll probably be running. Uh, you'll be running Grand Theft Auto, and because it's such a big world, it'll be really extensive on your CPU. And it doesn't it'll work. Be pulling loads of power off it because it's a big world. Obviously, there's lots going on. Whereas if it was just on a racetrack, that's not really too demanding because obviously it's such a little uh, jerry can. Uh, it, I don't know what I'm on about. It's just a little <laughs> area, so you don't have to re uh, load a lot if you know what I mean. Yeah, I don't think Falls would work to be quite fair. 
I mean, GTA 3 works fine. I was expecting it to have a few problems. It did at one point, but I got I got past them. I actually installed all three classics yesterday. Uh, GTA 3, Vice City, and San Andreas. They all work fine for me, except San Andreas. San Andreas just loads, and then when it loads, it goes into the black screen to uh, go to the next part, and it just stops loading and crashes. That's weird. And to get out of it, I have to restart the entire computer. <laughs> Dude, I could not go a week without playing San Andreas. I literally, the, I don't even get to play it anymore because it doesn't let me. It's, it's like not one fair. of my all-time favorite games ever. It's probably. I'm not sure. I'm not sure which I like. I'm really. On San Andreas. I love San Andreas and I love Vice City. You know what I mean. I'm it's really hoping that one day, they um bring Hogs of War and Driver Two remastered to like oh, the PS4 or something. I, I want them to. Because uh, brilliant. Because you know Fallout Four, yeah. Yeah. You know Fallout Three is my favorite game ever. It still mm -hmm. is. Is this really? Best game I've ever played. Still. I've got the fucking glitch with the flying death claws that I was telling you about. <laughs> I remember you telling me about that once. But yeah, uh, I was, was uh, watching that. Uh, no, I don't know what I'm about. One sec. Uh, I want them to remaster that, but not just remaster the graphics in that, but completely remake it so that it fits Fallout 4. Because what they did when they brought out Fallout 4, they changed loads of the lore, if you know what I mean. Well, they like messed up the timeline. Uh, not the timeline they messed up. They, they, it's on the same timeline. It's just set in. It seems like it's set in another universe, like a parallel universe to the other. I hate how I hate how they did that in GTA. Yeah. It's like we're not bringing CJ back. He's in alternate dimensions. Like really, you're you're using dimensions as a plot line. Yeah, like uh, yeah, like uh, the cities are completely different as well, aren't they? Yeah, it's weird. But uh, yeah, uh. Was, yeah, Fallout, bothers me a little bit as well. Uh, what they've done, uh, like one of the things that they changed, which uh, I wasn't, I didn't really like it at first, but I kind of do like it better than the original system now, is the power armor. It's because before it was just a set of armor that you put on, and it was like any other clothing item, if you know what I mean, but it just did loads of damage resistance. Uh, but you needed to, uh, you needed to join the Brotherhood of Steel to use it. You needed to, like to be taught how to use it. I saw this really. Whereas in Fallout 4, all you need to use power armor is a fusion core, because the power armor is now a vehicle. And it's not something that you you just put on as clothes, it's something you, like, get inside and run around, and it's like a vehicle, it uses fuel and that. I thought and, something... Uh, I kind of like that now. But uh, <laughs> and, and one of the best things is you don't take any fall damage if you're in power armor now, in Fallout 4. I saw something really funny yesterday, right? It, oh, yeah. Do you know the meme, that really old meme of somebody passing a note back and then they look back at them with an angry face? Well, it was one with Big Smoke holding, giving one to CJ and he looks back and on the note says, I'll have two number nines. <laughs> I was watching a, I watched a video yesterday. Uh, it's this chan the new channel. It's uh, his first video and he gained about 30,000 subscribers just from uploading it. Why, what was uh, it? It was how big was Big Smoke's actual order. And oh, I've actually... seen that in my thing recently. Yeah, he actually, using the Clucking Bell website, he actually uh, figured out what he ordered exactly. He ordered about 3.2 days worth of food. Really? And he'd probably like, eat them all in the car. Hey, yeah. come on, Smoke, shoot! Oh, hey, know, I'm just finishing my fars! <laughs> Those are my favourite things, I'm just finishing my fars! Yeah. And then there's Claude, just... I love how um, in the cutscenes, they're sat there hey, yelling at him, he's just staring at them with a blank stare. Just yeah. a five second death stare. He's just dumb. Awesome. It's because he never said a thing. Yeah. That's what makes him even cooler. I'm still, That's I'm still undecided I like on about the Fallout Three New Vegas. Is that you didn't actually talk in it? I'm still I undecided like, like on what happened at the end of GTA Three, though. Like you know how there's a gunshot at the end. I'm still under, I'm still under, like what happened? Like did he kill Maria? Or what really happened there? Really. <laughs> he probably did. She wouldn't shut up, would she? He was like, oh my god, and he was like that. And then that's it. I, I, that last mission was awesome. I loved that last mission. I noticed um, whenever I boot up GTA 5 on the PC, there's always an explosion instantly. And I realised that's probably the sound of the game loading, like an ambient sound or something. <laughs> like, And also, the weird thing is, every time I enter the city after being in the desert, I hear an explosion. It's like, who's shooting at me? What have I done? I haven't done anything yet. Oh, yeah. I have this, um, I have the stun gun, um, gravity gun mod. I pick, I picked up a bus and threw it at another bus. Shit. And then I, 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 I like... Is, uh, a little bit. is it? I love, um, I love picking it's people like, up really with quiet. it and, like, throwing them to people. I don't know why it's doing that. I don't know if I don't. Oh, so, do you want me to leave the call and go back and see if it works better? Uh, I don't know, maybe. You could try it. 
Ah, schade. Hey, oh god. <laughs> Is it any better now? That did not work. I could not hear you at all. <laughs> Why? It's like whatever what, what, for what, the for whatever reason as soon as you as soon as the call started I heard my voice in the um in the oh, headphones it was really static and bad it was like <laughs> I was like oh god <laughs> share your screen with me again oh yeah I forgot to do that actually <laughs> yeah, so what's what's really annoying me is um like I still haven't found a single shiny on sun and moon it's driving me insane. <laughs> Never um, you're gonna hate me for saying this, but I've never actually uh, properly played Pokemon. Really? No, I think I play. I mean, I'm not. I'm not gonna. Park. I'm not gonna murder you. <laughs> <laughs> I just. I just I'm really. Kill you because you still haven't seen Star Wars, by the way. Oh, that's your revenge. <laughs> that's your revenge on me for not seeing Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've never seen your. I've never seen so your favorite move series. <laughs> <laughs> you just you watch and go my revenge on all of you. <laughs> we we just couldn't stop laughing for like a solid fifteen he minutes. Like stares at you and just starts like moving his fingers slowly. <laughs> and then like outside he jumps on you goes Whoa, and starts like biting your ear. You're like, what are you doing? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Didn't you just say you gotta kill us? <laughs> yeah. I think it was you really funny idea. how we talked about it in the other video, but when we were fighting outside and we just fell over into the library. <laughs> <laughs> he just <laughs> That was just brilliant. It was uh, the teacher's reaction. I remember at college the um the whole pigeon thing happened again. Like this pigeon flew up to the window, and just <laughs> like interrupts in the class, and I just went, "Wait a minute!" That was awesome. It's the way it <laughs> when we were at school, it's the way it flew into it three times in a row. Because we were just we were just sat there, and there was this kid in the class telling racist jokes, and all you hear is just <laughs> from like, "Wait a minute!" It happened again. I was like, "Wait a minute! Is that the same pigeon?" <laughs> I proceeded to tell the entire class the story of the pigeon that we saw that time. I look at this person. Olga. Olga. Wait, she looks like Edna from Bully. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, kid. It adds flavour to it. <laughs> oh, look at this. I've got to wear this sombrero. I have to wear it. It's like a rule. <laughs> Please wear the sombrero for the rest of the... <laughs> it actually looks really cool as well. Every time I see a sombrero, it always reminds me of, um, remember when Homer Simpson had that one filled with cheese and he was like dipping his nachos in it? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it just kind of reminds me of that. I was watching The Simpsons the other day. People are always complaining the, about it. It's well. one of the new ones, it's where they get taken to the alien planet. I don't think I've seen that one yet, I've seen the Cuba one. It's alright. I went, I went back and watched Midnight Alex again, that was one of my favourites. To be honest, the, uh, I still reckon that the, the Treehouse of Horrors are the best ones I've ever made. I think my favourite one is the one with Lard Lad. Yeah, yeah. It's like, got your donut, Lard Lad, and what are you going to do about it? And then he goes, Wah! and then all of them just come to life. Yes. I remember we were watching we were watching that in science class once, and uh, me and my friend at the time were like really into YTPs. So you know the um, kind of the magic carpet guy? He did that yeah. thing where at the end where he smashed into the building and went, squad la we are off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I was what? Yeah, I was watching the Triassic Horrors the other day as well. It's the uh, urge to kill fading. Fading. <laughs> Rising? I love that part. Fading. <laughs> Urge to kill. Fading. Fading. It's Rising? Fox News. <laughs> Fox News at 11. Urge to kill. Rising. <laughs> <laughs> it's wonderful. <laughs> I still remember the first time um, Triassic Horror, it's just Nevermore. Yeah. I, I think my favourite one ever was the one with Maggie when she had tentacles. <laughs> ding ding ling. <sighs> Hmm, that's odd. Usually the blood gets off of the second floor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the best bit. Usually the blood Come on, guys, the let's go home. Very well, I'll drive. <laughs> I need blood. I love the leprechaun. It's like, ah, oh, it's hard to die. It's like jumping on some dead guy. Yeah. <laughs> do, you remember that, do you remember that episode with the Grinch? He's got like blue blood. He's like, wait a minute. I, yeah, yeah. He's like, that's not the guy I've been following. Or something like, I don't remember what he said. He said he was like, "Wait a minute," and then he said something really funny. I just don't quite remember what it was he said. 
Simpsons hit and run. Episode like where hit, uh, not, I nearly said Hitler for some reason. <laughs> where Homer was uh, King Kong. Oh yeah, there was. Actually, you know what? Um, how you said Hitler, it kind of reminded me of something. Um, yeah. a few a few months ago, since then last year, there's this YouTube I watch. Uh, called yeah. Game Boy Luke, and he hit 95k, and he did this Amigo meetup. And I met some guy on there. Um, I was like resetting it, and then there was just this picture of Hitler. And all you hear was, <laughs> I was like, what the hell is this? What is this doing here? Why is it here? I also found a pig on there. I was like, what are you doing? There's <laughs> just so many trolls on there. It's like it's like when you see a picture of like a a big YouTuber. It's like ha ha ha, kill yourself. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Excuse me. I just it was weird because all you all you got was just Hitler's just ha ha ha, like a really really bad quality laugh. Do you know what that reminds me of? <laughs> what? I've just wasted <laughs> ten seconds of your life. <laughs> Remember that struggle at dinner time to get on those year 11 tables? Usually I'd be the last person to get there and I'd have to like steal some kid's seat or like... Yeah. I'd, I'd have to like sit far, far away from you all the time. It's really annoying. Mm. <sighs> that is how you make a taco, you dump half of it on the table. Isn't it kind of weird how like whenever we make up a time to like do these videos something comes up and it takes like two hours longer? Yeah. <laughs> wow, what's always happen? <laughs> I mean, this this time it was a Counter Strike time. What was it last time? I don't know what it was. Uh, Didn't you get home late or something? Uh, I don't know because we only really we we can only record these at the weekend because that's only that's the only time you're available. Give or yeah. take maybe a few nights, but you know. I can't remember why. I can't I've also realised we never record on Saturdays. Always only on Sunday. Yeah. I'm actually oh, running. Like, I'm actually running out of Saturday, videos. Just let me know, like in the morning or something. I'm always available on Saturday, like all day. Actually, maybe give off take me a few times because sometimes I like to go out shopping because I like to stretch my legs a bit. So do a few. Is it just me that gets loads and loads of bloody uh, contact requests off of random people on Skype? Uh, no, maybe I don't. I got like, I didn't. I've got about twenty that I haven't replied to because they're all bloody weird. One of my first Skype account, right? I I was so I was so stupid because I sent contact requests to all my favorite YouTubers, thinking they'd respond. <laughs> <laughs> it's like yes, it's like yes, this person is definitely going to respond. Yeah. <laughs> the moment when your when a favorite when one of your favorite YouTubers insults one of your favorite things, is, and it's um you know that button where it's like about to karate chop the button and it says unsub. <laughs> I saw that the other day. Did you see the Sun and Moon meme I posted about Nebby? It was like, please reinsert yourself into this container of flexible material with urgency so that you can so that you will not be seen by random people who want to capture you. I actually did see that. <laughs> I don't know why those those get in the bag memes are so funny. There was one where it was like click the clack, get in my sack. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, I was on a I was in the gamers group, yeah. And uh, it just gets spammed with shit. There was one which was a. Uh, it was a uh, like for regular girl and love for gamer girl. And then and then it's like and I, I and then it's like ignore it. ignore for I, this mutant. <laughs> I just put in it. I don't know because both of them nag after you've married them. <laughs> <laughs> how many how many nasty replies did you get saying you're so mean you? <laughs> No, no one actually, but I just got a load of likes for it. <laughs> That's weird, actually. I was expecting it to be feminist. Like, you're really, really sexist. Uh, you can't say that about females. Because uh, females are the master race. Uh, <laughs> Praise we'll, Gaben. We'll kill you in real life. We will find out where you live. Sounds about right. <laughs> <laughs>